Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's me again here, Landoran. Giving you more System Shock 2 once more. I've had a hearty plate of spaghetti bolognese, so I feel ready and safe to take on the eldritch horrors of deep space on board the Von Braun. So let's just check out this area that we haven't quite explored yet. Oop, nanites over. And a load of chimps, who all appear to be dead, which is nothing I'm going to complain about. Yeah, research log, and... Oh, this is very useful, this is a surgical unit activation key. If we get one of these, all we need to do is find a incomplete surgical unit and plug it in, and there we go. For five credits, we have a perfectly functional heal-all device. Uh, we've already got one on this level, so I will save this for rainier days. Oh, yeah, we've already checked that. Let's listen to this log here. Angela, while it may appear that the lab monkeys are communicating with each other, I assure you it's quite impossible. You claim that one monkey signed the passcode for a supply closet to another, and the latter proceeded to open it. As I'm sure you know, there have literally been tens of thousands of studies of private intelligence, and there's no evidence of behavior There we go. Intelligent monkeys. Obviously, that man didn't come at the time when the monkeys were going around throwing psychic fireballs at me. Another log. I can't race anybody down in engineering. With the lifts out, I'll need to get down there through the emergency conduit in the Psy Annex. I think the access code is in Watts' lab. Oh, sound of chimp breaking glass. So first, I should probably take down this turret so I don't have much time left. I stuck again. Not the best clipping in the world. Chimpies. Feel my wrenchy wrath. There was a uh, log which I forgot to play there. Oh. Never hurt to have too much healing. Yeah, we've already checked these guys. And though I am wondering, this door's pretty flat on the ground, so there's obviously nothing in underneath it. Yet here we have two severed legs in some very attractive boots. Possibly Mark Jacobs. And then we have two corpses here with all the legs that a human usually comes with, so obviously there's a guy wandering around who's just a torso and arms. Okay, so we're going through here. This is the key card that we found on that corpse earlier. You've made it into the crew sector. Now find Dr. Watts' room. Oh, there's some paintings. Oh, boobies. We'll hide these with our wrench, make sure it's YouTube friendly. Here we seem to have a uh, Ottoman scene. Um, 17th century. And next up we have um, um, a forest outside Munich filled with cherubs and women in very skimpy pajamas. Or possibly foam, I'm not sure. There's a bit of a. Is that a woman got a mustache? Don't know what's going on. <coughs> Oh, and here we have uh, the Mother Mary, the baby Jesus. 
which seems to be feeding him some grapes. Uh, we've got a donkey in the background and um, a man who appears to be playing golf. I'm no art critic, but usually in pictures with the uh, baby Jesus and Mary, you don't put a man playing golf. It's considered bad form. Another log. We have picked up a transmission from the surface of Tau City 5. I've been in negotiation with Captain Diego of the Rickenbacker, and after some coercion, he's agreed to go planet side as a joint venture. Imagine, this historic mission might even become more historic. First contact. And who is there to get exclusive rights to all media patents and land grants? Triaptalum. Merely, I told you this would be worth it. Actually, the Russian guy lives there, and we can tell it appears to be filled with Jack Daniels and bottles of very strong vodka. I have died and gone to. Ooh! Paradise. A grenade. Oh, it's a broken grenade launcher. Well, unload it. At least we have two fragmentation grenades now, even though I don't have the skill to unjam it. Hello, sir. Hit me with your rhythm stick. Hit me. Hit me. Oh, God, I hate random explosions and those ghosts and stuff. I just hate anything which. I'm fine with the weird, creepy zombie shit. Doesn't bother me. Explosions? Yes, those bother me. Those bother me greatly. Do we have here? Brawn, danger, high explosive. Probably best not to go through that. Here we have, uh, this is basically a perk terminal. We can choose a one time only perk, such as healing. What we really want, though, is probably the ability to store extra crap in our inventory. So we get, yep, three extra slots there in our uh, pack, which is nothing to be snuff laughed at. Ooh, pack of fags or cigarettes if you're a foreigner. Booze, I've died and gone to heaven. Let's have a Glasgow night out. Vodka, orange, more vodka. Whiskey, pack of fags and stop off some bubbly. And a potted plant to throw up in. No, that was charming. Uh, upgrade terminals, usually that means we're in a sort of safe zone. No, oh. oh, it must have been the cigarettes that damaged my health. Not the possibly about three or four litres of alcohol that I've just consumed, giving me irreversible Please liver damage. Please make your selection. never be able to hack too much. And research is a good idea, so we can now crack open this hybrid organ and once that's done um, we can do extra damage and have a look at its Please squishy insides. Now let's hack this vending machine and see what cool crap we can get out of it. See, we get better stuff and it's for cheaper, just like in Bioshock. No, oh, they stole so much. Oh, mind you, it was a couple of the same creators, so... They just reused it. Security forces have been alerted to your presence, intruder. The glory of the many demands your capture or destruction. 
Ah, the band, the subway sandwich. Oh crap, he's got a shotgun. Oh, why am I having another one of those? I'll just... I'll put this down here with the rest of the hybrid. <laughs> Gotta love, like, old style physics. Ah, oh, I just want your gun! Oh dear, where are you? Hello. This is Zaxis. Oh crap. Remember, grab the meter restrictions are in place for the good of all of us. All unauthorized interface. Oh, that was nanites, not the only degree of the law. The camera. Uh, there's another weird thingy up here. And a uh, handgun. Let's see if we can No, you can't. Oh, Jesus, where did you come from? God damn it, I wish I was psychic. Okay, let's have a check through here. What do we have? Coca Cola, TM. And um, peas. That's wonderful. We're stranded in the middle of space and the only thing we have to eat and drink is Coca-Cola, vodka and peas. Hate bloody peas. Oh, that appears to be there. Shield. How do we get through that? Radiation. Try optimum computer terminal. That's fantastic, but what does it do? Oh, it's turned this off. Medical kit, champagne, and more combat armor. Just what I've always wanted and needed. Oh, no. Security camera. Should no longer be a problem. Oh, more grenades. Was actually intelligent enough to know how to fix the grenade launcher, that would be useful. No, let's just set this to the baby Jesus and Mother Mary, see if we can bring a bit of holy pacifism to the life of these chaps. More cigarettes, you can never have enough cigarettes. Oh, what do we have on this one? To Jesus. The power of Christ compels you. Oh, and the toilets. A massive tap. It's not a tap, that's a shower head. And... Ooh. A pile of disgusting worms. I shan't even ask. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm thinking somewhere around here I'll find somewhere safe to stop off in. Watts isn't here, so he's probably in his office in the R&D sector. Maybe he's got a backup R&D card in here. Take a look around. Yep, I think this is a good place to stop for now. This is Landoran signing off. See you next time, people. Au revoir.